True forgiveness is uncounted. Matthew chapter 18 verse 22. No, not seven times, Jesus replied, but seventy times seven. Forgiveness is the willing initiative to plead guilty for the wrong done consciously or unconsciously. On the other hand, it is also the magnanimity to accept an apology without being critical about it. The text is Jesus' response to Peter who came up with the question of how many times he should be able to forgive someone who had wronged him. Jesus was point blank with his answer that he should be able to forgive 70 times 7. What Jesus intended was the unlimited time for forgiving. The Jewish people had this idea of forgiving someone up to three times and therefore for Peter to have come up with seven times was something unimaginable. To forgive someone who has wronged us, we should have experienced a similar forgiveness from others. If that has not happened, it is going to be hard to forgive. Kindly listen to the incident that I read in a church bulletin. There was a Scotchman who had formerly been a notable character, a prized fighter and a gambler. Changed by the grace of God, he became a mighty soul winner and on many occasions his message were a great blessing. Just before he arose to speak at one service, someone sent an envelope up to the platform. On opening it, he found it contained a long list of sins and crimes that he had committed in that very city. At first, he felt that he must run away. But stepping boldly to the front of the platform, he said, Friends, I am accused of crimes and sins committed in this very city. I will read them to you. One after another, he read these charges, and at the conclusion of each, he said, I am guilty. When he had finished the whole list, he paused for a moment and then said, You ask, how dare I come to speak of righteousness and truth with a list of crimes like that against my name? I will tell you. This is a faithful saying, and worthy of all acceptation, that Christ Jesus came into the world to save sinners, of whom I am chief. The forgiveness Jesus offers is sincere and complete. Therefore, it is important that when we forgive, we must forgive from the deep inside of our heart and never say, I will forgive you, but not forget you. That cannot be total forgiveness. True forgiveness is uncounted. God bless you.